Meanwhile, former U.S. President George W. Bush criticized the withdrawal of NATO troops from Afghanistan and said civilians were being left to be slaughtered by the Taliban. Afghan women and girls are going to suffer unspeakable harm, and this is a mistake. They're just going to be left behind to be slaughtered by these very brutal people, and it breaks my heart, Bush told German broadcaster Deutsche Welle. The former Republican president who sent troops to Afghanistan in autumn of 2001 after the September 11 attacks on New York's World Trade Center said he believed German Chancellor Angela Merkel feels the same way. Most of the 2,500 U.S. and 7,500 NATO troops who were in Afghanistan when U.S. President Joe Biden detailed the final withdrawal in April have now gone, leaving Afghan troops to fight an emboldened Taliban seemingly bent on a military victory. President Biden has insisted, however, that it's time for U.S. involvement in the war to end and for Afghans to chart their own future.